Morning everybody, welcome to Little Tahunga. This should be a good fun one. It uh, it don't look like much, but my man Walton here tells me uh, I'm gonna be surprised. So thank you so much yeah. for coming all the way from Utah with your 61 Fairlane. Seven. Seven, 67 Fairlane. Apologize, 67 Fairlane. Uh, tell me a little bit about this car. So I bought this car around 2008. Mm -hmm. um, it was a 289 for a uh, three-speed automatic car. Okay. And I drove it for a while, really enjoyed it. Um, the transmission let go, and that started everything. The slippery slope. The slippery slope. Well, it's a four-speed manual now. It's a four-speed manual. And you said it's a Hypo 302 up it, front, It's right? effectively a Hypo 302 with, uh, I ported the cylinder heads myself. Okay. Um, long tube headers, aluminum intake, and right. a quadrajet. Okay, and, and suspension, brakes, anything um, like that? Suspension is basically all new but factory okay i have done the shelby drop lowers the upper control arms um roller spring perches and uh strut brace and uh disc brakes disc brakes up front four piston kelsey hayes all right with ebc yellow stuff i am excited is that reverse or is that first wait let's see that feels like first let's uh yeah there we go I'm excited for this. Yeah. Oh, it sounds good. That sounds like a glass pack. Is it? Yes. And you... It's, and uh... They're 27-inch glass packs. Dual. You, you drove this thing all the way from Utah. Yep, 1,500 the, miles. The long way. Yep. Did you have any issues along the way? Or Not there? one, except for that. What is that? That is my new drive shaft. The U-joint uh, on the front is uh -huh. rubbing on a exhaust hanger. Okay, well... Brake pedal requires a lot of pressure. Yep, manual brakes, manual steering. <laughs> it's really meant for roads like this, I can tell. Yeah. Well, you being from Utah, you've got a lot of straight roads. Yep. And then a lot of open sweepers, not a lot like this. So we're gonna go down to where it's a little more open. Still getting a feel yeah. for her. And I would highly recommend uh -huh. you do a first gear pull to six. Okay, I will as soon as I have room for yeah. that. Hey, yeah. Is that it, that's not gonna break on me, right? No, that's no, good. it's absolutely fine. Okay. Oh, it sounds good. And you've got these like floor vents down here that are blowing some nice cool air on my on my bowl sack. <laughs> it's fantastic. You know, for not power steering, it's it's not so yep. heavy actually. This actually was originally a power steering car. Uh-huh. And then I deleted all the power steering components except for the box so it has the quicker ratio okay quicker ratio with no power assist yes what do you what does this thing weigh about 3,000 not too heavy considering uh, what it looks like which is a giant land yacht <laughs> I can't believe you did 1500 miles you're such a boss that's amazing <laughs> thank you uh oh the noises are happening well, it, re it runs really nice and smooth. Engine feels great. Is the motor a, a brand new build motor? Did yep. you find it somewhere? Um, I found the short block rebuilt. $300. Oh man, that sounds great. I'm trying, uh, I know there's like sharp corners coming up, so yeah. I'm trying to not completely fry your brakes. Downhill is going to be harder on this car than the yeah. uphill, I can tell. But I bet this is a great, like, highway cruiser, huh? Oh, it does 85. Awesome. And what RPM are you at at 85? Uh, 31. Okay, so what is like a 355 in the rear or something? 279. Uh oh. Oh, boy. I love this steering wheel. Did you say this was a Grand Wheel? It's a Grand Wheel, Grand it's, Classic. It's really nice. It's got these finger grips like a Beretta in the back. Mm -hmm. I haven't even left second gear yet. I'm waiting for a little straightaway so I can leave second gear. One of my yeah. favorite signs. Oh, no! Oh, sorry. Oh, no, fine. My bad. If it's made it this long, it can probably yeah. handle that one. Come on. And this is the stock sway bar too. Really? Yeah. So is this what this car would have handled like in 67? If Shelby ever put his hands on it. Okay. I love how it sounds. Yeah. Sounds great. Oh no. Oh, oh. <laughs> Pardon me 
if I don't entirely yeah. trust it. No, that's fine. It's a great cruiser though. This road opens up a little bit yeah. down here so we can uh, we can get on it a bit. And then we'll go back up the hill so we're not just on brakes. Flat to the floor. 4,000. Yeah. <laughs> the brakes are taking a workout for sure. Yeah. But it makes a re it makes really nice smooth power. Oh, this is such a cool cruiser, Walt. Man, Thank I you. like it. And it's very. Where did you find these seats? What are these out of? These are out of like a mid '90s song. <laughs> They're comfortable. The yeah. Dri the driving position is really good. Yeah. The, uh, the 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 visibility is great. All right, let's uh, let's flip around. Oh, easy to heel toe. Yeah. Let's flip around and we can do a, a proper pull, as requested. Uh, for can I just downshift oh, yeah. first? I guess. I go. Oh, wow, I've, first is so long. I, I've gone into first as high as like sixty. <laughs> Did, you, did, you, I, did I hear you say before that first is good for 70 miles an hour? First is good for like right, 69 wait, mile an hour. Where's reverse? Up there it is. Got yep. It. Oh. Hang on, we got cars coming. They are Pirellis. I forget the exact ones. Four Season oh, Plus. Oh no! There we go. All right, it's first gear full pull. Flat to the floor. Like this. How is PCH? 
Well, it was, it was actually not too bad traffic-wise. A lot of fun. Yeah, uphill, way better than downhill. Yeah. But it's it's pretty easy to drive. I mean, it's, it's definitely on roads like this a bit of a workout, but... Yeah. But if you're not trying to... Uh, to really, really push it, it's, it's really fun. Yeah, it's really great at that seven tenths. Yeah, I agree with you. And so the odometer is showing 25,000. Is that since you put that odometer in? That's basically since I built the engine. Wow. Uh, when I built the engine, I also did the instrument cluster and all of that. And I built the engine about two and a half years ago. Good for you, Walt. I, I, I think the world needs people like you to... Because this, if this thing is reliable, you yeah. know, and it's it's comfortable and pretty quick in a straight line for what it is. And where you're from, this road is an anomaly. Oh know? yeah, most of the roads are much wider. Yeah. The roads through Zion maybe are nice, but... Yeah. I actually spent an entire summer in St. George. Mm. Nice people. Yeah, it's nice down there. Yeah, doing the national park thing. Oh, that noise makes me nervous, but but nothing else about yeah. the car does. You gotta get a lot of pressure on that brake pedal, though. Wow! Thanks, Walt, man. This yeah, is super cool. Okay. I, I really, I can really appreciate that this thing doesn't look like much, but mm -hmm. mechanically, it feels incredibly sorted. Uh, it sounds good, rides well, it's comfortable. Yeah. You did good, man. You thank did you. good, and, I, and thank you so much for coming all this oh, way. It's, it's my pleasure. I, there's no way if you said from Utah that I wasn't getting you on the schedule. <laughs> this is great, man, and I and I wish you the best of luck with it going forward. Okay, thanks thank for you. coming down, man. Yeah. Of course, thank you guys for watching. Love the oddballs. Keep them coming. Send me your weird stuff. I will. Uh, I'll see you later.